Oh, let me, I got to say this. You guys have defied the odds this season. Uh, you guys have gone through so much adversity, whether it's injuries or lineup changes or what have you. What's been the key to keeping that glue together in that locker room with your, yourself, LeBron, AD, and the rest of the team? It's just, it starts from our leaders. It starts from the front office. It starts with the coaches. It starts <clears throat> with our vets, and everybody follows suit. Um, this team is extremely, you know, together. You know, um, a lot of teams say that, but this team is, is – you know, it feels like I've been on the team for five, six years now, and uh, we're just extremely close. And, uh, you know, we love facing adversity. And uh, obviously being a Laker, we get everybody's best shot. We know that. I'm going to compete for a championship, but we don't cheat the process. We take it one day at a time, one game at a time, one practice at a time. And, uh, you know, we just fall in love with getting better. And we have, you know, guys, you know, from the top of the bench and the end of the bench who can contribute, as you saw last night. So, uh, you know, it's a really fun environment to be around. I'm just thankful to be a part of the team. Now, this has been a special team. You've been on championship teams before. What makes this team so special in your estimation? And is it different from the teams that you played on with Golden State? Obviously, you know, every team is different. Um, I think we're, you know, we have the talent first. Um, we have the coaching staff first. We have the, the standards set by the Lakers organization. Um, and then you just have to have, you know, guys who are willing to sacrifice. Um, guys who are together. And, uh, you know, it's always good when you're on a seven game, eight game, you know, winning streak. But, you know, when you lose two in a row, when you lose four in a row, how do the guys come together? How do you respond? And, uh, you know, we've done that pretty well this year. So, you know, got a lot more games, but, you know, I like our chances. How fun has this experience been for you thus far, um, coming into the fold, being around a guy like LeBron James, being around Anthony Davis and the coaching staff, and just Rob Palenka as the GM? It's been great for me. Um, obviously, growing up being a biggest Lakers fan, um, obviously, you know, being, you know, the biggest Kobe and LeBron fan growing up. Um, I was with LeBron in Cleveland for a little bit. I was his rookie. He was my vet. Um, me and AD is one of my best friends. Obviously, we grew up playing against each other in high school and being All-Americans together. Um, and, like, Rob, like, you know, he's he was Kobe's agent. So, like, growing up, you know, you know just knowing him, oh, wow, that's Kobe's agent. Like, I got to meet him one day, stuff like that. Now he's, you know, the GM of the team, president of basketball operations, and uh, he does a great job. He's always around us. You know, he's, he, he's just great, man. And this is a great, you know, uh, place to go to work to. Now, you being here at California Strong, the second annual uh, event, obviously going for a great cause, helping the people in the community. The Lakers have always helped people in the community. What does it mean for you especially to be here to lend your time and efforts? I'm just, just give back, man. This, this, this is a tremendous thing that they have going on here. And uh, once I heard, out of, heard about it, I was all in. And, uh, you know, just want to – you know, give back, give time back, give whatever back just to um, help a great cause like this, man. And I'm just so fortunate they invited me out. And uh, hopefully, you know, I could be here, you know, anytime they need me. Hey, man, well, congratulations on all the success. Pulling for you guys. Uh, we're going to get that float down, Figueroa? Yeah, that's, that's the plan, man. We got a long way to go, but that's the plan. And one and only Quinn Cook, man.